this here is the kitchen there are some main points here to see there are a few cupboards on the bench top you can see a pump tap which works to draw water from a fresh water tank there is also a drain that feeds into a grey water tank that are located under the sink along the top of the bench top at the far end here is a hinge which contains a full gas bottle in the middle of the kitchen we'll find the stove top um, pretty easy to set up it just comes out on a drawer and then you screw in the gas hose pipe which just lies below it um, the drawer locks which is a nice feature um, once you've screwed it in it's good to open we just want to open it with the two sides and in you'll find a lighter that easily lights the hobs as you can see there's two burners here which makes it much easier to cook uh, a nice meal um, it's pretty hard to cook a nice meal on just one stove head below the gas meat which is again real easy to pack down and it just looks nice and clean when it's not set up all the time um, below it you'll find a cupboard and in that cupboard there are various pots pans uh, utensils and everything you need the last area of the kitchen here is this uh, drawer which opens up this way under it you'll find um, a dish brush um, spray and wipes and bags just basic clean cleaning stuff but this drawer also acts as a um, bench top which makes it much easier to prepare meals because uh, you can chop food and mix stuff up here so yeah that's really handy and into the bedroom in here you will find uh, two drawers one of them is a nice large drawer uh, it's a nice large drawer which contain which i use to put my clothes in um, there's also some jumper cables here which yeah i just gonna look there and the smaller drawer which is a long drawer which uh, i find perfect for my uh, toiletries and then, um, toothbrush etc behind the big drawer here there are some six by nine speakers because the factory ones on the vanette are shocking they are paired also with a sub because you're going to be doing a lot of hours driving and you want to make sure that you've got some good quality music let me show you how the bed sets up really quick um, there's two little latches that you need to undo and then this slides across and this clip right here which holds the slats in place and then the mattress just pulls over and uh, gets stuffed in and there you have a pretty much a fully made bed And to pack up the bed, you just do exactly the same in reverse. Real easy. And there you go. You've got it um, packed away. Up is the cockpit. Um, things of note is we have a Bluetooth touchpad um, headset. We have an alarm. Uh, which flashes blue when it is on alarm light um, we have a pull down uh, tray drink holder and tray the tools this van contains are a squeegee to wipe down the condensation in your van um, under this plywood base there are a wheel jack and some tools for changing a tire under the kitchen you'll find a full spare tire which is really nice peace of mind um, if you're interested in traveling in New Zealand there's so many freedom camping spots now you should look check out uh, and download CamperMate uh, if you're in a self-contained uh, vehicle it has all the spots around New Zealand 
that uh, um, you're allowed to go and stay for free. It's been awesome being able to get out and see um, the beautiful New Zealand in this, and this is what this has allowed me to do um, the year that I've owned it. So I'm real thankful and um, I'm glad to see this be passed on to somebody who will use it well.